Hi, this is Shane, and welcome back to another episode of Peace of Mind. And you might be wondering, where am I? It looks like I'm underwater. I am. Um, I'm not drowning. I'm standing on something. And you're probably very baffled. Well, let's bob up to the surface. As you can see, I am in deep ocean. And now I'm under the ocean. I can see rather well. I've got night vision. And you can see I'm not drowning. What I have, I mean, it's not sorcery. It's definitely not sorcery. What I have is a, where is he gone? A squid pet. It gives you water breathing, night vision, swim boost, and you can sink down when you sneak. And its favourite food is raw fish. And I've just been swimming around and exploring. And I was going to do something slightly different today. Something totally different. I wasn't going to do this. And then I was swimming and let's go across to here, to this hill. And I came across that underwater building and it's like, uh, what is that? So I thought we might as well explore it together. I think I have, I do have my pickaxe with me. So let's go and see if we can find out what it is. Because I'm very curious. I'm very, very curious. Probably will, uh, well, yeah, let's let the water in. Alright, let's... Okay, can we not get in? There's a slab. Oh, there's a slab here. Alright, let's brick you back up. Alright, and I think there is a... There was a lamp, some, a, a torch somewhere? Did I pick it up? I don't think I did. But I've got night vision, so it's okay. Yeah, cobblestone. I have no idea what this is. I've never seen anything like this before. Maybe it's some kind of rate. It's a church. Is it like an underwater church? Is this where is like was there supposed to be um a village is it some kind of derpy kind of i don't know this is a weird place because i'm not seeing any there doesn't seem to be any kind of um what's down there those are just torches. Doesn't seem to be any kind of treasure or anything. I think this could be just derpy generation. Well, look at that. Very strange. All right, let's head back out and let's do some more exploring. Uh, that's the only thing you can't get out. All right, let's put that back up together. There you go. That water will disappear. And which way was I going? That's where I was last time. We're going this way. So yeah, once you've got a squid pet, actually the inventory pets, I mean, you've seen me use the, um, the chicken. We've got the, we had the home one as a quest reward. There was another one as well that we've had, but the squid pet is arguably the most useful because it gives you, you know, you can swim and you can swim faster. And there's loot chests under here. I don't know if we'll see any more. I had found one earlier with it had lots of fish and water buckets. You know, you need a water bucket when you're underwater, obviously. 
But um, but yeah, the squid pet is arguably the most useful, at least in my eyes. And then you get to see all the all the wonderful coral from biomes of plenty. We probably should eat something though. Let's sink down and where's my sandwiches? Oh, sponge! I picked up sponge from there as well. Picked up some of the coral. I don't know if it will act like vanilla coral. I had sandwiches. Let's switch out the sand for sandwiches. And I can eat underwater. Although, is my... Well, my game sounds really loud. I can't remember. I've had this problem recently where I've been recording and the game sounds are really loud. But when I'm actually playing the game, it's not loud. Options, music and sounds. Let's turn the master volume down. Just to be sure. But yeah, I'll be recording and I'm listening to the sounds without headphones, mind you. And they don't sound all that loud. But when I've actually played back the recording, it is quite loud. In some places it can be overpowering. So I, I don't know what the deal with that is. Uh, we still, we're still in deep ocean. Homer's back that way. I'm trying to see if I can see another one of these um, little shed things that has has um, treasure in it. Oh, there's one. So they look like little floating huts. And then of course it's really... Oh, did I turn up? Options, videos, brightness, bright. I don't know if that's helped any, but they've got tons of stuff in here. More water buckets. I don't need any more water buckets, thank you. Uh, pig pet. You can eat poison food and gives you pork chops. Okay. It's nice. Emerald, obsidian, and uh, more sponge, lapis, fish, iron. Yeah, all of that. Actually, we need need back two buckets of water because that's what I had in the first place I was trying to do that fishing challenge thing where you're supposed to catch the four different types of fish um, and have the empty have water buckets in your inventory it goes in the bucket I managed to get cod and the salmon oh where are you going right that way please forward forward thank you <coughs> Excuse me. Um, I did that, but um, and then I came and I was fishing somewhere else. I caught a puffer fish, but it went straight into my inventory instead of into the bucket. So I don't know. I mean, I'm not quite sure why they want us to catch all of them, and I'm not sure why it went into my inventory instead of the bucket because I had the water bucket there, and um. I don't even know. Do you get puffer fish only in the ocean? Does it have to be in a particular biome, or can you get them anywhere? Because I know if you are fishing in a in a like in a pool of water, a puddle of water, you get all types of fish. So do I just stick around and wait, or what? I mean, it's a bit of a weird, a bit of a weird quest. Let's try fishing here. Where are we? We are probably... Okay, we saw some puffer fish just now. We're fishing on the ocean. Are we going to get anything? And I know this is not the most delightful thing, watching me fish. Oh bit quick off the trigger there I don't know I think I think you get vanilla fish okay what was that uh, oh, am I full I might be full um, okay
Do we have anything in here that we want to get rid of? Uh, iron nuggets. There's more iron nuggets. And the sponge. And one more thing. Red cave crystal. Okay, so what did we just catch? Raw octopus. Yeah, in the ocean I'm getting lots of Pam stuff. But, um, yeah, there was a puff of fish. It went straight into my inventory. It didn't go in the water bucket. So, I, I don't know. Maybe I'm not being patient enough. I should stand on the fishing dock in front of my house and see what I get. Because this is linked to another quest. Alright, what's that I got now? Uh... A clownfish. But that's supposed to go in the bucket. It said to keep... Maybe I should have it on my... Raw char. Right, let's keep it on my hot bar and see what happens. Uh, nope, that's a Pam's fish, raw walleye. Uh, okay, something else, and then we can move on to exploring the seas. Something's coming. I don't know what that was. I have no idea what I just caught. Oh, okay. It was in the... Well, that was in front of me. Um, what else can we get rid of? Eucalyptus planks? Don't need those. Oh, God, that's ugly. Oh, it's an eel. Okay. Alright, well then, let's go and look for something else. But I mean, it's fun being able to swim underwater and not have to worry about drowning. Is this where we just came from? I don't know. I think this may be where we just came from. This time I am not going to... Uh, no? Oh no, we didn't. There's a new one. Crafting table pet. Okay. Um, sponges. This, we can get rid of the egg. Take the sponge. Raw fish. We can always do with more raw fish. Um, three. Gas tier. Didn't we have some iron nuggets? Yes. I know. Um, Ender pearl. I want all the stuff. Uh, toadstools. Don't need toadstools. Don't need. Don't need the berry. Or the potato seeds. Or the tomato seeds. The seeds we don't need, apart from vanilla seeds. And the red orchid. I don't see the point of those. Um, okay, that's now looking a bit better. That is definitely looking better. Right. So you want the crafting table pet. The egg. Not the egg. We don't need eggs. Diamond. Lapis is always good. Iron nuggets. Always good. So yeah, so those... So I didn't realise you can get the craft... The um, the crafting... The inventory pets underwater. I always thought you could... You only got them in the air. 
because you get them on clouds basically. Okay, let's go a little bit further. I think this is where we're supposed to come onto land. I have no idea how many blocks away I am from home. Let's turn back. Where are my home is 3,000 blocks away. Which is... Uh, where, oh, my chicken pet is not on my hot bar. Oh! There's a church with a graveyard. And that thing. A sprout. I have no idea. I don't know. I don't know if I want to know. So is this what had spawned underwater? No. We get lo lots of um lots of item frames. And the fact that the item flame frames are floating in the water does that mean that this structure was built as we loaded the trunk? I don't know. So, there's a black terracotta, but it looks brown. But yeah, it's a church with a graveyard. Which is pretty cool. I like these kind of structures. I don't know what mod puts them in there. But it's a cool mod. It's a very cool mod. Uh, Indian hellebore. Do these give you colour? It's from the plants mod. Oh, it gives you green dye. Oh, okay. Suddenly occurred to me, it might give me some colour. Okay, right, we can stop exploring now, I think, and go home. Oh, trust me to get stuck on the on the cobweb. We can go home and see if we can get something done with the remainder of the episode. Although I could quite happily spend all all day just zooming around the seas right let's see oh there there's okay where's home all right maybe i should map all i don't know if it's going to map everything between here and, oh yes, it is. It's mapping everything between here and home, where I left it, I guess. Is that another village there? No, that's just, oh no, this structure. What's that? Thing. It's over there. It's only 200 blocks away. This might turn out to be the Explorers episode. Okay. Oh, I thought we went. Oh, we did. I was supposed to put the chicken back on my hot bar. Because once you get used to zooming around with the chicken, you don't really want to go back. Oh, is it another one? Of, oh, back in the water. Right. I think it might be another one of those dungeon things like we have at home 
We are back. Okay. I find this game crashes a lot. Um, okay. Does this not have an entrance? Yeah, it's like the one we have behind our house. Yeah. I mean, all it is is a, it's some kind of dungeon. Nothing of interest. Oh, good grief. Maybe I should take the chicken off my hotbar and not run around so fast. Sorry, dear. Oh, God, that was such a bad pun. I didn't mean that. That was an unintentional pun. Okay, let's see if we can get out from here. Hello, cow. So where are we? Oh, no. Oh, oh. Those lights. Those are fairies. That's part of... Oh, I forget which mod that is. But they're fairies. You get them around... Look how cute they are. You get them around like uh, a pond like this. I think fairies or sprites or something. And you see them at night. I'm not quite sure what they're for, but they're cute. Okay, we've got lava going on. Why am I exploring? Oh no, I'm exploring out here because I wanted to open up new chunks. Are we in extreme hill? No, we're not in any extreme hills. Uh, there's what? Barley? Reeds? Over here might be extreme hills though. No, still, still meadows. They're very tall, but they're meadows. And we have two, we have a merged chicken over here. <laughs> two headed chicken. What's that in that book? Uh, um, Dr. Doolittle, a push me, pull you. The two headed animal. They had a head at each end. Well, there's lots of animals and stuff out here. I'll have to remember that. Did, oh, I do that all the time. I remember too late that I've got to jump. Is that another bone block? Yes, it is. Okay, let's have a look at our map and see what it's done. Yeah, I think it just it just mapped everything. So you can see how far I've swum. Because I started here, where it says stop. And I swam all that way through the ocean. And I have no idea where that is in relation to home. Okay, um, it's a pity you can't zoom out anymore. Home is here. We're, we're well, yeah, I mean, as we saw, we're over what, 3,000 blocks home, 2,000 blocks away, I should say. Uh, let's see, home, yeah, 3,000, 3.3,000. So let's teleport home and let's see what else we can do. Okay. I 
Oh yes, I picked up the Ashen Ashen Wheat last uh, after last week's recording. I went and um I was picking up the crops, and I got that. But we had to finish these two. Smoking uh, Sundergrass. Okay, we'll have a look at that in a sec. Wait. Oh, okay. Um, let's put some stuff away. Can we pick up anything? Yes. Do I not have any... I probably don't have any dyes. That's why. Uh, let's open this loot chest. More soul sand and quartz blocks and glow glow worms, glow sticks, glowstone. Okay, the ender chest, ender crafting. To craft, right click, and it likes wooden planks. Okay, let's get a stack of planks. Uh, do I? Yes, I did. It's eaten one, so right click. Oh, that's nice. That is very nice. Bonus hunger saturation. And its favourite food is carrots. Soon my hot my hot bar's just gonna be full of pets. Nothing else, just pets. Alright, let's put the no, no, we're not gonna put the food upstairs. Let's have a look. Um Thundergrass and scintilla wheat. Okay. And then we have honey. Use the honeycomb and a presser to make honey. I think these we need to devote a whole episode and not a couple of minutes. Ah, uh, tinkering away. Oh, that's all the lights, the little things. Maybe we should look at the little things. Iron ladders. Oh, Quark. Quark is a, is a cool mod. It adds many little things to Minecraft, one of which is iron ladders. While they are expensive to make them regular ladders, iron ladders don't have to be placed on a block, so you can make freestanding ladders. Okay. And what else do we need to do? Iron ladders. Okay, let's see if we can do that quest line quickly. Ladders, metal, iron. Okay, and we get some chains. A trowel. Quark by... A trowel added by Quark is great for making parts. Alright, we got the trowel. When right clicked, it would randomly choose a block from your hot bar. Okay. Okay, we have those two blocks. Okay, so. Okay, I'm not quite sure what the point is yet. Crafting pet, don't need that right now. Yeah, I'm not quite sure what the point is because it just seems to place blocks. But, okay. Dispenser upgrade. Okay, Quark adds tweaks to dispensers so when placed in front of a tilled, in tilled soil and filled with seeds, a redstone signal will plant the seed. This works with vanilla seeds, some modded seeds, jungle wood, cocoa beans, nether wart, soul sand, and chorus fruit endstone. Dispensers now also place blocks in the world instead of dropping the block in item form like a dropper you can also dispense records into jukeboxes if the jukebox is empty okay so they want a dispenser and that dispenser 
Okay, and we get 16 more dispensers. And a piston. We want a sticky piston and an iron rod. Do we have any pistons? There's pistons in the village. Oh, my bridges. I made a bridge. I made three of them. But the the nether brick and the red nether brick that I got as, as a reward, I made three bridges. One here, one above here, and one behind the house. So at least I don't have to keep jumping in the river all the time. Okay, sticky piston is a piston with a slime ball on top. Piston and a slime ball. And what did they want? A piston and a stick or iron rod? And we have, oh yeah, there you go. That's it. And another loot chest. And we finished off that top row. We didn't, oh, we didn't claim that loot chest. Okay. <clears throat> so before we finish off the episode, let's have a look in our loot chest and see what other absolutely wondrous, splendiferous things we get. Are you, this, the trowel has durability on it. Okay. More red, uh, coal and iron. Yeah, that's fine. We can always use coal and iron. And more glowstone, soul stand and quartz. Okay, we don't need that. But I'll take it anyway. Right, let's take the other bridge and go home. It's so much nicer than jumping off into the, into the river. And also, that brown stuff, where is it? Is any on this side? That brown stuff is quicksand, because I managed to get a bucket of it. Okay, it might help if I made a hole where it's surrounded by water. Yep, got a bucket and quicksand bucket. So yeah, a bit of a fun episode today. Just went exploring in the ocean. Got lots of fish, couldn't find any puffer fish, at least none that want to jump into the bucket. And we polished off a couple of very quick quests. So thanks very much for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe. It always helps to grow my channel. And I will see you in the next episode. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye bye.